Hello, welcome to Angie's Craft Corner. I'm Angie. Today we are going to kind of swing it by the seat of my britches again. I don't know, I kind of like not having nothing planned. And we'll see how this goes. Um, I know some people would say no, not to do it, but... You know, sometimes you have to. Well, I do. And you, as you can see, I still got stuff out from a card a little bit ago. So, but this is a set of May May stamps. May May made it. Dot com. And I'm going to use some of these. I'm not exactly sure probably this one to make a, a my background and I got to figure out what my cover is so anyways like I said I'm going to just kind of swing it by the seat of my britches so to speak and see how it comes out if it don't come out, you know, it's always, it's just paper and ink and time, you know. So, no big deal. Can we make it interrupted? <sighs> Who knows? I got to figure out where my dog is. Okay, I'm going to use the Island Indigo. Hang on. Okay, what did I tell you? I knew he was going to call. It, he always does when I'm trying to record a video. So, y'all just bear with us. He ain't at home and he don't know what I'm doing. Hmm. And I'm just going to make And if you don't know I am working on plastic So it can be Erased Does anybody else like to build their own backgrounds? Besides me? How's that? You like that? I think I'm going to clean my stamp and my paper. Now I'm going back over it, I think, with uh, uh, Hello Honey. Hang on. Okay, let's try this again. 
I got Reba coming. Those may me. Okay. I'm going to just dust this off like so. Y'all see what I'm doing? I'm making a mess. Because I don't want a whole lot of yellow. Just enough to make it look different. My May, get your tail end back up here. She's got, well, she follows our big dog around. And I am scared to death she's going to get out in the road and get killed. That would break my heart. Let me tell you. And I don't know if I can ha I can't handle that right now. And for the ones that don't know, I, I lost my dog, Snowball, a couple weeks ago months ago. Now, I ain't over that one yet, but, I mean, I do love my May May. But it's not the same. Who knows that? So, how's everybody doing today? Are y'all liking all these videos I'm posting last few days, last few weeks? Now, y'all seen me transform this from white card stock to... Where's your ball at, May May? Where's your ball? Go get your ball. She took a ball out inside to play. Oh, you know how dogs is. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, I'm going to wipe this off. Well, I won't get all of everything. And this is why I like to work on plastic. I mean, it's just like kind of working on glass. And I work on glass a lot. So, you know, I'm good. Good with that. Okay. I'm going to take that and stay zone. And I'm going to take this floral stamp. And if y'all don't know, stay zone will stain your stamps. Including your blocks. You can get a special cleaner. I don't know if it really works as well as it says it does. Because I've never tried it. So. And if Stays On wants to, would like to send me some. I would more than gladly to try and see what I think. Okay. I'm going to use Spectre Norse to call my uh, flower in. And for that matter, I didn't think I'd ever like stays on ink. But I do. For the ones that's wondering. I do like it. I got a feeling she's into something she's not supposed to be in. Oh, 
Oh, did I tell y'all that I'm getting a new door for my craft room? That is glass. So this somewhat I can see out and maybe not get so depressed. Um if you know what I I I'll mess looking out. If y'all don't know that about me, well I'm gonna do now. <clears throat> I love being able to look out. And seeing what's going on. And yes, I'm that nosy old lady that's on the every road, street. That's me, as my husband says. I like to know what's going on. I can tell you which vehicles belongs on our road and which ones don't. If that tells y'all anything. <laughs> and I'm really not that nosy. I just like to know what's going on. <sighs> Because you never know this day and age. And a lot of times I've got the scandal going out here. You know. So. And sometimes I'll forget about it. And leave it. On. While I'm videotaping. Because they've been quiet. And then once they start talking. And I'm like. Uh oh. <laughs> so. If y'all ever hear that. Don't think nothing too much about it because that's just my craft room and uh my mate's doing good for the ones that is wondering um she's hyper full of energy you name it she's running up and down the ramp outside she loves to be outside She's, and she's into something. I just don't know exactly what. She's on the other side of my desk, and I can't see her. But, usually she's into something. Y'all know how kids is. She's just like a little kid. So... You know, you just go with the flow and keep on going, as I say. Um, did I move that? Oh, maybe not. Okay, I'm going to just make this into a square. Well, maybe. We'll try this again. Hmm. We probably don't have the crooked one. See, the ones that think I never make mistakes, I really do. I make a lot of them. I just want how to cover them up and yuck. Well, people don't know it. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. <clears throat> to me, it's a good thing. But some people would say, no, it's not. So. Okay. I'm going to take my pink. More, um, my CR2 form. And I'm just going to. I'm going to color all of this in with this. My May, what do you have? Did everybody have a good spring break? Mm -hmm.
Okay. Now I'm going to use art glitter glue. Let me find my art glitter glue. I may not be able to find it. Well, that would be the pit. I've been trying to order some more of it. Uh, I don't see it. Huh. Guess I won't be using that. On that. Anyway, that one bottle. Uh, I'll have to see what's going on. But I will use this. This ain't the one I wanted, but I guess it will have to do. Hi, Reba. You want to say hi to the video? She's like, no, thank you. You want me on video? Oh, what did I just do? Okay. Oh! See y'all? Y'all don't think I make mistakes? I make tons of them. No, wow, I done that. So, with that being said, we're gonna have to cover my mistake. Yep. Let me wake up a minute. <clears throat> and I'm just going to color this not professionally because I'm cutting this out. We hope I'm cutting it out as bad as I colored it. I'm just doing a quick job of it. And I'm going to do a lot of uh, fussy cutting on this. So... And y'all can see how much I do fussy cut. Because I'm going to do it. Who's all ready for Easter? I can't believe it's already Easter time. Um, uh, I can't cut and concentrate, so if y'all wanting to know what's going on. So, how many dog levels do we have in here? 
how many cat lovers? Ouch! Something's biting me. Yeah, that one's perfect. But y'all see how I'm coming up with my mistakes? That's what I'm saying. Y'all may never think I make mistakes, but I do. I'll be the first one to admit it. Okay, I'm going to use these um, from Paper Studio Sticky Sticky Doos. Huh. I ordered these the other day. Didn't know if I'd like them, but so far I do. I got uh, the square. Well, that ain't what I'm doing. And the sprinkles. I think the sprinkles might not be. And they was like a dollar and a half a piece. Yeah. Well, well, look, there's a hundred and two hundred and I don't know. There's a bunch of them. The foam is, I mean, the dots, I mean, the squares is thicker than the dots. I do, I did figure that much out. If that says anything to anybody. <laughs> But if y'all know me, I don't use too many pop dots. I think I've used more pop dots in the last day or two than I have in a while. Let's use some of these little ones. And I'm using a pokey tool. I mean, I don't know the real name of this. And I'm not going to stress about it, as May May says. Um, like some, most of y'all know, if y'all watch me at all, that my dog is named May May. And she got her name because every time me or my husband would say May May, I watch a lady named May May Made It dot com. And um, every time I said, May, we, one of us would say May May, She'd stop and look at us. So, she got her name. She's she's nine weeks old. And she keeps me on my toes. I forgot how much time and effort a puppy does take. Now I'm thinking, why did I do this? But she's brought a lot of joy to my life. And, uh... So, and my phone keeps on going off. But I'm going to put this on little pop dots. Like so. And then I'm just going to pop it up. Right here. Oh, goodness. And let's see, what do I want to put on here? Thinking of you, uh, yeah, let's say, let's do thinking of you. And I'm going to use some white cardstock for this. If I can find the right block. And I'm trying to just use one block for my stay zone because I don't want all my blocks black. If y'all know what I mean. <clears throat> and I'm just going to cut, make this into a flag. 
like so. But we will try this again. We may have to do the whole thing. No. Okay. No, I'm happy with that. And I'm going to, to use the blue um, alcohol marker to color that this in. And like I said, y'all don't have to have a lot of, if you don't have room for cardstock, my advice is get ink, ink, um, uh, markers and ink pads and white cardstock. I mean, as y'all can tell, just by this, I've, that's all I've used was white cardstock and then I just kept adding when I needed to. Um, I've done that for years. I love how, how it comes out. You know, a lot of times I don't have an idea of what I'm doing. I just, I just start doing it. Yes, I've made mistakes. Who has it? It's paper. Any, you know, it's no big deal to start all over. I mean, the more you start over and do it, the better you'll get. And you won't stress about it. I mean, there's no sense in stressing about any of it. It's just crafts. It's for, excuse me, I do it for fun. And I know a lot of people don't understand why I do what I do. I enjoy it. Um, I mean, I can spend days out here in my craft room. Some days I'm really productive. Some days I don't get nothing. And I mean, nothing accomplished. These is the beads that I melted down about a year ago. I mean, I done a lot of them. And I'm still using them. And I'm going to get my real memory. Keep real memory. Keep a quick stick. And uh, I got this sent to me a couple of days ago. And no, like I've said, I've been crafting for years. I've been dealing with it itty bitty stuff for years never thought i would like one of these well i hate to tell y'all this if you do small rhinestones or small stuff this is a must i mean look how easy that was And yes, the door is open, so y'all will hear traffic go by, uh, the dirt road traffic go by. We do live on dirt road. We live out in the country. I don't have it any other way. I've lived in town, but the town I lived in, thankfully, was kind of like living in the country. It was, it was fine. I mean, it didn't bother me. There's some towns that would drive me nuts. But Charleston wasn't one of them. Matter of fact, 
My husband asked me the other day when I moved back to Charleston. I'm like, in a heartbeat. It's just a cute. It's an a town. It's a, just a nice, friendly town in Arkansas. It's a small town. Everybody knows your business. Pretty much. I wasn't out in town a whole lot. But what I was, it was friendly. I enjoyed it. And I just not. <clears throat> Matter of fact, I go back as often as I can. And we are dealing with ants. It is springtime. Now, um, if you wanted to, you could put a flower inside. I think I'm going to. And I'm going to just use my stay zone. Y'all seen my mistakes? I don't edit my mistakes out. I used to. I used to would start all over on the video. And my husband's like, why are you doing this? I'm like, because I made a mistake. Why are you going to think you ain't human? Well, y'all. Um, I am human and I do make mistakes. I mean, let's face facts. Who know? So, that's why I forgot why I don't edit my videos and take a lot of stuff out. So... Okay, this traffic's going by again. Okay, we're going to fussy cut this out. And these stamps is from Wish.com. Um, I don't know. I will see if I can find the link to them. I love, I just love the stamp. If y'all ain't figured that out yet. <laughs> Because I think I use it about every video I do. I do buy a lot of my stamps from Wish. And I get a lot of my stamps. And my a lot of my dies from Wish. Because they're cheaper. I mean, I can spend 15, 20 bucks and get four or five sets. Where here in the United States, I can spend the same amount of money and just get one set. You know, let's use logic. Yes, it does take a month sometimes to get your stuff in. I'm fine with that because I forget about ordering it. And it's like Christmas. Like, yay, yeah, I've got some happy mail. Well, did I order this? Well, when you go back and look, yeah, maybe. <laughs> you know. So, I, uh, I try my best to keep up with what I order. And I'm waiting on some stuff now from Wish. I even ordered May May a doggy blanket. And I ordered a reusable doggy diaper. If y'all ever seen one, they're cute. She probably don't think so, but I do. <laughs> Okay, and I'm using C C CG4 or 
CR4 and CT2 on this. If you're most wondering, wondering to know, and it's Spectre Normals. I have got the whole set of Spectre Normals. I do like them. I haven't got the little ones or the newer ones. I'm debating on um, do I want them. Um, Spectre Normals, if you want to send them to me, I'll be more than gladly to use them and try them. And I'll probably fall in love with them like I've had the rest of these. It took me a while to get my, my, my complete set. It took me a couple of years. Because I would just buy so many at a time. And finally I broke down and I finished it about a year ago. And uh, still ain't figured out the best solution to store them. Right now I've got them in makeup cases. That seems to be working. I've got them on my desk. With the lids open. And in the lids. I've put my stamping blocks. A pair of scissors. You know stuff. My pokey tools. My uh, wink of Stella. And uh, my cricket tools. And you know. Different little odds and ends. I've got two of them. And that seems to be working great right now. Now, for how long that's going to work for me, I don't know. And then when I got to a crop, all I have to do is zip the little suckers up and off we go. Not having to move them. And that's that's a blessing to me because I get so torn of moving, having to put stuff back up. I love going to a crop, but I hate all the headaches of go getting stuff together and then when you come back home you have to put it all back up I'm just like oh and my lazy yes when it comes to that and then my husband's like why do you want to go you, you've got everything in your room you've got it set up like you want it I'm like I know but it's just I need that I need go you know be with other people every now and then of like minds I mean my husband is not crafty he does get my crafty and he don't gripe about me spending so much time in the craft room if he did we'd probably have issues the only thing he asks is me spend time with him and I try my best to equal my time out if he's not home, yes, I'm in the craft room the whole day. But he's home 98% of the time. So, with that being said, you know, we spend a lot of time one-on-one. -on -one. And um, we do enjoy our, each other's company. You know, for years I could not understand my mom and dad. Like, and to spend all their time together. And I'm like, why? You know, well, I finally get it. It just took me 44 years, or oh, 40 something years to get that. I get it now. And, you know, my mom and dad celebrating on 50th, 4th, 54 or 55 years of marriage I wish I hope I've got that many with Joey you know some days I, I wonder <laughs> but we haven't even been married two years yet so if that says, tells y'all anything some people says we, how we act we've been married a long time we really haven't but we are really comfortable with each other. We can't, you know, we know we pick on each other um, for our wedding. Joey decided he needed to put, uh, my dad needed to have the shotgun. And um, my dad took the blame for it, but it was Joey's idea for the ones that don't know. And uh, 
when my that preacher is my brother that married this when he pronounced this husband and wife my dad cocked the shotgun and says don't bring her back and my dad still says that. <laughs> so joey stuck with me and uh, but i i thank god for joey He's been a blessing to me, and he's been, he's he's really good. He he spoils me rotten, and he lets me craft and enjoy what I like to do. He does what he likes. I do what I like, and if you yeah, I don't know Joey, he loves to get a good bargain on something, and he'll he'll even. I mean, he just, that's just who he is. Um, you never know what's going, he's going to bring home. The other couple, a year or so ago, he left, left me in bed. And when he came back, he was pulling a, a boat behind him. So, you know, you never know. We just say we've got another yard ornament. And for the one, I say we live at Stanford and Sons. It's a running joke. When I met Joey, he was saying, um, telling me all the stuff that was in his yard. And now remind y'all, we live on a half acre. And uh, he was saying this and this and that. And I'm sitting here like, Oh, my goodness. This is Stanford and Sons. You know the movie or the sh TV show Stanford and Sons? That's a junk doodle. Well, that's what was going through my mind the whole time he's telling me this. And, uh, anyways, he, he was really concerned about me seeing this place and all. And I'm like, he said something one day. I said, he said, it's not really as bad as you think. I said, yeah, you, you know, um, I think you live at Stanford and Sons. And after that, that's the nickname. I mean, I, I tell everybody we live at Stanford and Sons. I mean, there's more stuff around here. I, I, I don't even know what's behind my house. So... With that being said, <laughs> if that tells you how bad it is, I don't want to know. That way, I, I can't say if we've got it. I'm like, I don't know. You have to ask Joey. <laughs> I don't want to know the details of what's in, around my house. As long as I can't see it, I don't care. And my main focus is the side of the house and the part of it that faces the road that's about all I see so you know we laugh about it but it's true it's it's Stanford and Sons and uh, maybe not that demanding but it's it's pretty bad but it's getting better I'm gonna add some Wink of Stella to this blue one And just give it a little bit of glimmer. And I quit talking. <laughs> I got busy. How do y'all like that one? Okay. But anyways. Goodness. That's been a long video. For me, <laughs> I tried to rush through it, and I, I did it today. So, here's um, the card doing, starting with white cardstock for the background. Uh, using um, a stamp to do the blue from May May, May Made It. And uh, I will have the links in my blog at angiecraftcorner.com 
Um, and just using cotton balls and ink, uh, different color inks to make the background. I used a pink and a yellow. And then I went with a different stamp set for the florals. And the thinking of you from wish.com. And these I made myself. I just bought a big old bucket of them. I still think I've got some somewhere. I might have finally done all of them. I don't know. And uh, then this pink was white. We just used uh, spectral markers to color it in. And um, now the, the card base is a colored green. It was laying on my desk. But it matches, and then we did the uh, one the little flower inside and cut it out. Easy peasy, well maybe not easy peasy, but it is it's different, and uh, that's what I like to bring to my channel is something different and not the same stuff all the time. And if anybody. If you follow me or know me from cropping with me, knows I do a lot of my backgrounds myself. I love it. I mean, as y'all can tell, my hand stays filthy. They hardly ever clean. I mean, maybe as soon as I get out of the bathtub. Then they, if I'm in here 10 minutes, it seems like my hands gets inked. But I'm okay with that because it's just for the life. So, with that being said, I'm going to get over here today. 46 minutes. Some of that's just yakking. Alright, y'all have a blessed day. And I'll see y'all next time. I hope you like this card. Give us a thumbs up if you did. And subscribe to the YouTube Angie's Craft Corner. Um, YouTube and subscribe to my blog. Join us on Facebook at Angie's, Angie's Craft Corner. And I will see y'all next time. Have a blessed, blessed.